What's up guys, it's your boy. Welcome to the channel. On this channel, we talk about hot shot, core hauling, how to be successful, and how to make it work. You're also gonna get tips and tricks on hot shot car hauling and hot shot trucking. But, most of all, you will not get the small mindedness of people around the world. So if that's something you're interested in, like, share, subscribe, hit that ding ding. Now let's roll on into the video.
right, guys, so we got them all on, as you can see. But I'm, we're gonna do some rearranging. So I want this back further, that back further. I'd like to get that off the flippers if I can. And I can. Um, see that? I'd rather have a little hang off than that now. You know what? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. And reason being, I'm selfish. I don't like stuff over the cab if I don't have to be. It don't have to be. It may kill wonderful hot shot. We can't have a dead hot shot. Man, that's a purdy rig, but she gonna get washed today. <laughs> can move all right guys here she is fully loaded i gotta hurry the battery's going dead this one's got three straps a frame strap and then two on the tires now he's got four um as you can see i cradled over the tires um actually i am going to put one more on that one um you know this is you get as close as you can with it and the reason i did it this way is because bourbons are heavier than the than the pickup trucks so we've got this this logo you make sure see i'm gonna move that um so you want to make sure that you know do your final walk around make sure nothing's hitting and rubbing gonna move kind of like i did there see how this one's safe um but yeah these are heavier that one's a premiere so that one's super heavy that's why it's on the back and also they have a little more overhang than the silverado so this is a three car load um this one's paying 750 going down to chicago uh 300 and i don't know 20 miles i deadheaded 40 miles to get it so it all makes sense it works out in the end so what i did here see how i just went into the frame and pulled it down i'm gonna do the other tire i don't like dealing with these tires because i can't get it as tight as i like because uh you know what i mean because i can't really reach i gotta get a ladder um but now i know i could have hauled these with a small car i do know that now so i can get three trucks and a car on here and uh we're actually gonna test that on monday or yeah monday so all right guys this is the load um and now earlier i told you about the wind how and you've seen how bad it's moving that truck i'm gonna post a picture right here somewhere and show you what it did to that flipper now that flipper is about 30 pounds that flipper is about 30 pounds um so i'll show you what it did in the picture and then uh we'll probably do a walk around on the truck for the next video yeah all right guys let me get strapped up bundled up tightened up rock on all right guys so that was me loading this load two suburbans one truck <clears throat> hope you enjoyed it um this video was made for part of a vlog and i'm having computer issues so i can't get the whole vlog together which would have been a lot longer so 
decided to just give you this loading, strapping down so you can see what's what. Um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Like, share, subscribe. Hit that ding ding. And I will see you tomorrow. Peace.